So Vern is one. Cool. So that makes you. Can you read it? A futurist adventurer. Excellent. Oh, so where's your next adventure? Not where Earhart ended up. <laughs> no, hopefully not. <laughs> yeah. And you were, what were you again? I'm a storyteller maker. A storyteller maker. And is it true? It is true. Yeah, nice. Of course, I might just be making a story to tell when I say it's true. <laughs> Wise guy. You'll never know. I think it's deceptively accurate. Yes. Hmm. It's got some layers of wisdom to it that I hadn't seen coming. Uh-huh. Tubular. Tubular. I'd like to step right up. You with the cane. Yes. <laughs> Future. Noam Chomsky. Oh. Who the heck is Noam Chomsky? He, um, <laughs> it's hard to say. He's, uh, he's, uh, into politics, but also into philosophy and languages. Philosophy. Yeah. George Boole. George Boole. Do you remember Boolean? I don't know. Boolean is true and false. Logic. And Bucky Fuller, he's um, Buckminster in Noam full. Chomsky and I guess Nikola Tesla. Okay. All right, pull her down. Pull it, pull it. You are an activist maker. Dum dum dum. Yeah, Tesla, and it's not. Yeah, I would say he's smart. So you've chosen. Go ahead. Oh, yep. Go ahead, pull. And that is Jules Verne. Okay, so that makes you. An adventurer futurist. Oh, oh, really? Is it true? Yeah. Is it true? Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, what do you know? Oh. Oh. Dancing. Just painted. Not bad, I suppose. Uh, Lashed together pretty well. The base I have to snip the, those off. Be good. Yeah, we'll so we shall continue. Creativity. Um, creativity oh, test, maybe? Uh, put these in the right Go place with doing. some tape and then lash. And then I can start uh, cutting the various now. wires so that when people make a choice, right. it goes up in a marker. This is the main indicate uh, on here. And it so turns, you can. A bunch of markers along here that create really what that type of pieces that creator you are. That. So um, like that. that's what I'm using, that. and the stickers uh, down, down, stickers on, on top. Task and task and I'm going off. through. So. Uh, West folks. I took away artist, musician, and poet, and which were sort of broader in terms of creators or more traditional to that. And then the I'm side. focusing Actually, more on uh, specifically kind of inventive makers and kind of stuff. There we go. Noam Chomsky is an activist. Here they are. Activist. The ball is on the bottom. Byrne is a futurist. And then, um, yeah, that was pretty well. Now so we're going to mark a future mark activist. <laughs> I think. And then sort of a green down. like that. And you're all back. Oh my god! I love you. Hello. Do you like it? Mary and, Shelley. And so if there's somebody that you gravitate Aww. towards, then you pull it down like this, and that wow. says that you're an adventurer if you choose oh Amelia goodness, Earhart. Like. Amelia Earhart's cute. Oh, I don't know. I think I really like Mary Shelley. Yeah. Thank you. And there's Jules Verne on this side. Okay. So there goes the Mary Shelley. Mary and Shelley. And that means... How do I tell? You can it's tell. The green tag. It's I the green tag. You're a teller, a storyteller. I'm a storyteller. That's, that's why I got you guys here. I told you the story about Steve Hunt. Right. I told you how amazing it is. And there's Ada Lovelace, the, the programmer. I know you're a teller. And, and a telepathic. George Boole, the logician. Who's going to pull? Who's going to pull? Who's going to pull? Who's going to pull? Have you met Russell Z? No. Oh, let's go meet Russell. Okay, come on. Beautiful look. Oh, look at those goggles. Hello. And you're a scientist Hello. to boot with a scooter. Have you met Dan Zen? And Hello, I'm Hello. Dan Zen. How to do? Good. Uh -huh. Good. Yeah. You guys are all kindred spirits. Yeah. Oh, you have. Yeah. 
Our, that's right. Steam on Queen. Uh, the Steam on Queen. Yes. Does it does it operate? It certainly does. He went down the main street with it, and it's steam powered. Wonderful. No kidding. That's impossible for that thing to be steam powered. Well, he'll like this because I think the wheels are overrated. Uh huh. We should go back with little steppers. Machine. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Nice. Beautiful. <laughs> Activate the third gear. Did you guys set up by the river to get a campsite by the river? It's not going to be far. <laughs> it's doing a dance anyway. <laughs> so you can transport it along with it. <laughs> Most people say, look, why not just two more times before the end of the weekend to uh, cycle a scoot from here to Toronto? I could build up enough pressure in that copper vessel to turn that wheel two or three revolutions. Oh my gosh, I thought so. <laughs> you can understand the value of such an invention. in the ice cream store. This is amazing. And so we've been in here. The Dan Zen setup is like so. And it's been bustling with people as well. Almost all my cards are gone. These are the spinny cards. Whoops, they spun. Oh, oh. Whoa, right on the edge. And then here's the tour with the touch screen. So um, let's see if we go on a tour. And how about the biography tour? And you can just uh, scroll up and see all of the things. And here are some of my physical inventions. Well, let's see, those are the people. Where are my physical inventions? There they are. Uh, it's fun with the big touch screen to play with this stuff. And the main bit of the museum is here where you um, go up the stairs. So there's going up the stairs. And there's Tilty. What I did is I said internet disabled. If you press on something, it says internet disabled. And then that goes away. And then this is the way back into the museum. And those tell stories about Dan Zen. And there we have the tour at the Dan Zen Museum. And Noam Chomsky? So that makes you a what? Uh, an activist, you chose Ada Lovelace, programmer. Cool. So that makes you a storyteller logician dealing with logic. So is this one down? That's good, yep. Okay. Just pull until it stops. We had little kids, like, practically hang on them. <laughs> and then who's that? Oh, Jules has had a long day, yeah. Okay, so Jules Verne. All right, that makes you an activist futurist. Is it true? An activist futurist. Yeah. And what were you again? Do you remember? You were an adventure storyteller, right? No, what was it? A maker storyteller. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Excellent. Well, well done. All creative, which would be me. Yeah, that's nice. A futuristic, a futurist maker. Sure. <laughs> oh, not bad, I would say. I can tell from your goggles that that's, uh, <laughs> that's what you are. Would you like to try? Okay, let me pull these down. And down. Okay. She flew across the um, the ocean. Well, maybe. Yeah. First. She never made it. Yeah, that's right. Maybe she did. And then um, the geodesic dome. Mary Shelley, the Frankenstein. So that makes you an adventure storyteller. Oh. <laughs> the palms have spoken. <laughs> Hello, 
I'm Inventor Dan Zen. Follow me to the stairs of the Dan Zen Museum. Here you can press on me and I'll tell you a little bit about it. And you can scroll up the stairs, so just drag with your mouse or your finger on your mobile device. Or you can use your scroll wheel, Woo! or page up, and you'll pass all of the people that are telling stories about Dan Zen if you press on them and arrive at the Dan Zen Museum ticket. In which case you come in, and you can find out info about the Dan Zen Museum, and you can either tour or explore. We'll take a look at some tours now. There's the Formation Tour, for instance. And in the Formation Tour, it tells you about how Dan Zen was created, and some of the early games and things like that. And there's other tours too. There's the Biography Tour, which talks about uh, the birth of Dan Zen and a lot of Dan Zen's physical inventions. And the Coding Tour, uh, talking about how the Dan Zen creations were made. There's also a Creativity Tour, which has all sorts of things. Um, there's uh, the Nodism Tour. Nodism is uh, Dan Zen's philosophy, and it also ties in with um, what's called the Creativity Framework. So uh, the Creativity Framework uh, can be found in many links uh, throughout the museum, uh, such as on the right there, or we'll press uh, a link, and we go to the Creativity Framework, and it's, um, it shows the mechanics of creativity. So uh, he's this Dan Zen fellow has uh, figured out how to be creative um, from a mechanical standpoint and some people think it's magical but uh, you should check it out and uh, the explorer section of the museum has uh, all sorts of a uh, here we are looking at the games on the Kerputnik uh, what do we call this one the Kerputnik conveyor uh, that's right and you can um, run this conveyor at your own speed and you can launch things and find out more information and so forth. These are showing the, the many Dan Zen games. Some of them are mobile ready and some of them were made for the internet before mobile was around. So it uh, gives you an indication as to which one's which. And there's even a section for mobile apps uh, specifically. So let's take a look at that one now. And the Kerputnik uh, conveyor brings up the mobile uh, sites. There's Droner that I just launched and Gobstop and so forth. Um, so this is the explore section of the Dan Zen Museum. We took a look at the tour section and there's all the stories at the front. So we hope you come to the Dan Zen Museum and take a look. It has been online since 1995, so in web world that is a museum. Have a great day.